normal. Welcome back to a new vlog. I've got my mask down because I'm around not a lot of people, or I'm not around a lot of people before anyone judges. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do a wee travel vlog. I don't know when I'm gonna end this vlog, I'll just see. Maybe I'll just do this, like, get into the place and then I'll start a new vlog. So yeah, I'm going to Thailand, very exciting. Um, flying now to Singapore and then Singapore to Thailand, um, to Phuket. So yeah, we're going to Phuket. I have been to Thailand before, but I didn't go to Phuket. So excited to see what it's like. But we're in the airport now and it's like empty. I think there's only two flights before like 11 this morning. Um, it's seven o'clock now and there's not one thing open. I'm absolutely starving. There's a donut shop opening soon. So I'm gonna have donuts for breakfast, which is lovely. There's a wee boy playing guitar in the middle of the airport. All right, let's do a taste test of a donut. Did she not give two cents on? No. I, I literally said her like three times. All right, we got sugar. I asked for two, can we give us one? And then, got like a pink one. Breakfast rolls. Mm. I mean the donut's nice but it tastes very fake. The pink. Sprinkles. Mm. How much taste of it? Right, let's try this. You can't go wrong, do you know what I mean? Got there. Shotgun. You can't even see your leg left. Does <laughs> anyone do that? Like when a camera's pointed down and they just do this? Or else, like when you're getting a photo, like under the pole, like you lift your leg or something, you're like, you can't even see your leg. I don't know if it's 0.5 I'm in the, the ghetto. Also, another thing, whenever you like have a mask on and someone like puts the camera on, you go, I guess, and you smile under the mask when like no one can see you're smiling, but it's just an automatic response. Like, I'm smiling now, you can't see. Also, Singapore and off here at COVID, they've got the water taps open. Yeah, they've got water taps open, which is ideal because. I go through water like there's no tomorrow um, and they were off in Bali airport but hi this is it that place is closed okay, we have arrived that flight was actually grand I think it was th two and a half hours I just watched some selling sunset of a knife um, there's these people driving about in like these suitcases that you sit on and then they're, they're like they're like motored unreal but it's, well, it's like 12 night our flight isn't to 6 tonight which is annoying um, and we have to go and like recheck our bags in and all so god knows what I'm going to be doing for the next 6 hours there she is best thing about having the day immigration it was right here when I came out and there's no one about <gasps> guys we have to get the sky train whatever that means um, to terminal 3 how exciting. Okay, so I think it's just that, which is very unexciting. Massive. Right, our flight later isn't till like 20 past six, and we just seen there's a flight to Phuket at 20 past four. So we're gonna go to the ticket counter and see if we can change our flight. We're not gonna pay for it. Like we'll just, if we can get it free, we're gonna do it. If not, we're just gonna chill for an extra two hours. Behind the scenes. What about that for an optical illusion? Isn't that cool? Inception. 
for fly change. We're going to tears earlier tonight. Oh my god, I'm buzzing. Means you get an extra tears. How exciting. Um, they don't have a free as well. That's right. Just went up and was like, we see there's an earlier flight. Can we change it? And they're like, yep, yeah, no bother. Just change it in two seconds. Imagine Ryanair doing that. Imagine they would never. They were flying with Singapore Airlines, so so far so good. Highly recommend. The crypto card comes in handy. Okay, so we ended up in the lounge, which is actually hilarious. Um, Dougie has like this crypto card that he pays for. I don't really know. He just has a crypto card. And it gets him free access in the lounges. And you can bring someone with you for like... It was like 30 dollars or something um which is obviously less than pounds and it's obviously cheaper just to do this rather than if i was to go like buy food somewhere because i think food's grew dear here what is that noise gonna get food here now store then and then we're gonna have a wee alcohol al alcohol alcoholic beverage So I just got an array of things here. I'm not sure what this is. Mashed potatoes, rice, veg. I think that's a hash brown and then this is a vegetarian sandwich. So I just looked at it. So he's halfway on his pancakes as well. I got himself a beer and a Coke Zero. I just went for the water. I'll get something after. He's possible. First to many. Okay. I mean, it's not as fucking safe as I thought it was going to be. Mm. Like, right, Mom, I'm going to let them out I think the other one was fancier, but it didn't have drink. Either way, I feel you. There's a few here, but the way that he gets it, one of the ones he couldn't actually get free drink in it, so we were like, what's the point? I'm going to go buzz it and get the second plate after us. This potato is actually good. I don't know. Get the veg in, you know. What do you do, no pancake? Because I don't want pancakes for dinner. Lunch? Lunch? Dougie has literally sweat and got himself a whiskey on the rocks. He doesn't even drink whiskey. Let me see. Johnny Walker. Really? <laughs> Would you drink your other drinks before you go get that? Sell cup of tea. It's not the same. It was just not the same. It, they didn't have like cold milk sitting out. So I had to use like the hot milk from like the machine and like turn it off really fast so it didn't give me like a full cup of hot milk. Um <clears throat> but I don't even think we've that long now that we've changed our flight. I'm gonna go get another plate of food because it was pure nice and I just want more plate. But I think I'll have this and then I don't know, I might take Coke or something. Um, we didn't go through security there, so we're like, do we need to go through security? Because we're like already through like um, like immigration and stuff. You don't want to leave here too early, like thinking we need to go through a pile of stuff and then just be sitting at the gate. But I think this airport is quite big. What is that noise? That is ruining my vibe. Um, I know. Here, there's a flight at half six, and I know there's two seats on it. I went up and got myself a sweet cake. It's, it's so orangey. Let's try it. It looks so like good though. Mmm. Oh my god, it's actually nice. I've never had an orange cake before. I don't think I do love a good lemon cake, but oh my god, it's actually yummy. And I got myself a wee Coke Zero. Didn't get a wee alcoholic drink. So we've been there. We probably need to go some. I think he said he's going to take me to a wee Gucci bag. Oh yeah. In Thailand, I. Ah, in Thailand, he says.
So you don't actually need a uh, PCR to come to Thailand. We don't need a PCR to go to Singapore or Thailand. You just need to be, you just need like a Thai pass. So you do all like all that online and then that's really it. Isn't that it? Well, you don't have to be vaccinated. To get into Thailand, I think. No, you don't. You can do quarantine. Really? If you're not vaccinated, I think you can quarantine. And if you are vaccinated, you don't need quarantine. So easy enough to get in. And those two flights were so handy. Okay, we just ended up getting a taxi like when we were inside the airport. You could have got a minibus, which was 200 baht each. Wasn't it, Eve? I don't know. Um, yeah. Thank you. Um, but we had to wait on like 10 people. There was only one person there. And then, oh, do you think you left that down for me? And then we'd have to like take everyone to the hotel. So like for the extra, like 400 baht, like whatever. Do you know what I mean? Okay, we've arrived at our hotel, so I'm going to end this little travel vlog now. And you can see the hotel, and you can see my time here in Phuket in my next vlog. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. Bye.